Continuing her diplomatic tour of South America, President Park Geun-hye spent her second day in Peru meeting Koreans who live in that country. She also had an opportunity to meet with Peruvian K-pop fans. Our Choi Yoo-sun reports from Lima. Referring to the dozen or so Koreans who first settled in Peru 40 years ago, President Park Geun-hye praised the current 1,300-member Korean community for their hard work and endless efforts to succeed in Peruvian society. For the past two decades, many of the Koreans who live here have offered free medical services to Peru's underprivileged. President Park said she was proud of their volunteerism as it not only enhances the reputation of the Korean community in Peru, but also that of Korea. The Korean leader then promised to continue to provide them with targeted support to help them live so far away from home. With Peruvians' increased interest in Korea, mainly due to an expansion of Korean pop culture, the president asked the residents to become Korea's civilian ambassadors and further promote Korean culture. It's estimated there are as many as 50,000 K-pop fans in Peru, and 15 of them got a chance to meet President Bak and deliver personal gifts, including a llama doll and a silver brooch. She thanked the fans and said their adoration for Korea will help the two countries become closer. President Bak, who had just come from a visit to an archaeological museum, also praised the sophistication of the preservation techniques used for the artifacts. On Monday, President Bak will discuss expanding bilateral cooperation to cover infrastructure, health care and defense with Peruvian President Ollanta Humala. There's also speculation whether her latest visit will pave the way for Korea to export its combat aircraft to Peru. Choi Yoo-sun, Arirang News, Lima.